Hey, even though I'm short as hell, I've still grown almost a foot in the past four years. Why do I bring this up? Because it helped me realize how big of a difference some height can make. I'm still not big, but during public runs I can get my shot over pretty much anyone, and I don't really gotta try hard either. And frankly, being able to do that is half the battle when it comes to being a little bucket. Scoring on contest, scoring through contact off dribble, that all comes with that ability and a bit of extra practice. So I'm going to give all the little hoopers some advice on putting the ball in the bucket. In the paint, be on the arc, anywhere you want. Just get into it. Here we go. First things first, um, get a mean floater. You ain't got to be going deep in the paint all the damn time if you can put the rock over the top. Same reason a nice hook will do you well. Going deep is why we get our shit smacked into another dimension most of the time but you also can avoid that by being slippery down low. You a small motherfucker, you gotta be able to slide through contact. You gotta be able to take it more than bigs too, but especially in pickup, it's better to duck it. The only thing contact is doing is getting you to the line and opening your shot up a bit more sometimes. Pick and choose. Being floaty is good too. By that I mean hanging in the air. Good hang time means good hops and core strength, right? Good hops alone gonna benefit you. Core strength is huge for everything in hoops though. Get both. Paint bucket's the most challenging for us, obviously. Bag this shit and you already way better than you were before. Let me keep it a beam. If you're gonna play at a competitive level over the age of 15 and be under 5'10", you gotta make your jump shots. Not an option to suck at them. So y'all already head of the game if y'all can do that. All right, contested shooting. Just listen close, listen close. It's all in your head, man. It's all in your head. Unless they're making contact on the ball, it's not affecting your shot. So, to pop it well contested, keep the same form as if you were open. And you're probably talking about, how I know they're not gonna block me? It's easy. First, speed up your release. Just takes time and reps, no sweat. After that, learn how to shoot your side steps, step backs, all them shits. You're gonna be OP if you can hit those. You gotta be able to shoot on the move to do that though. Get better at that with lots of reps. Learn how to take momentum into account. Just keep working until it becomes second nature. You can make some tweaks to your shot to make that easier. Let your hips swing in the air. Just let them do their thing, let it be natural. Also, you ain't gotta base your feet f to face the basket perfect. Honestly, it's probably easier to have them on a slant because it lets you keep your arm straight when you shoot easier. It rotates your torso away from the basket so your arm can swing more naturally at the hoop. Won't work for everyone, but it's worth a try. These are more for from deep though. In the mid range, it's a short enough distance, you should be a bucket regardless. It ain't just about the shot though. You gotta be able to get open. I already talked about this a bit with the step backs and side steps, those are good ways to open up. If you rely on just those though, you're getting clamped so hard it ain't even funny. You need a sweet fucking handle, and I mean sweet bro, you gotta have the dirtiest crossover on the court, Allen Iverson type of shit, Kyrie level shiftiness, Kemba level starts and stops. If you're gonna be small, you gotta do it all, no argument. There's a lot of drills you can do to level up your handle, and after that, you just gotta read the situation. Know when it's best to bust out what, and be aggressive. It's called offense for a reason, getting the defender's grill before they and yours. One more thing worth mentioning, being able to dish it will help. Other team won't want to double you as much, and will be more hesitant to call for help deep. Just keeps you open. That's what it is though, little bro. Get to it. Hey y'all, it's been a minute. Went from uploading once a day to once a week. Total shit, right? Whatever finals start this week and I'll be done with school next Tuesday, you know we gotta grind. Other than that, shit's chilling over here, man. Sub count been going steadily. Appreciate y'all for that. But I'm out this piece. Thanks for watching, y'all. Peace. <laughs>